Hello, I'm Vilnis Vesma, a specialist in energy saving and the author of this book, Energy Management Principles and Practice. Today's kitchen tabletop talk is about evaporative cooling, a method of chilling the air without mechanical refrigeration. So, uh, what's in the box, I hear you ask? Let's have a look. Just a couple of things. I've got a fan to keep the box, uh, to keep the air moving around the box, and a temperature sensing bulb there, a thermocouple connected to a remote readout so that we can see what the temperature is when we've got the box closed. Uh, the other thing that we've got in here is a pressure bottle which uh, when I pull on this remote cable will generate a burst of water droplets like that. So put that back in place. I'm going to put the lid back on the box and we'll just let it stabilise for a few minutes. Right, so we just left it for a few minutes there to let the temperature stabilise in the box and it's down at 19.1. And now I'm going to just pull on the remote control which will release that mist of water droplets and watch the temperature. As the spray enters the air, the little droplets have a very high surface area which makes them evaporate very readily, but the latent heat that they need to absorb to change from liquid to vapour is taken from the air, so the air uh, drops in temperature to give up some heat to evaporate the droplets and there we have it we've uh, knocked a few degrees off the temperature and that is the principle of evaporative or adiabatic cooling thank you